Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I will show you how you can transfer your WhatsApp data from your iPhone to your Android smartphone. Now, by far, this is the most simplest and the easiest method. First of all, you don't have to do any factory reset on your iPhone or your Android smartphone. The Android smartphone should not have WhatsApp installed because during the process, we will install it. So on my Android smartphone, I don't have WhatsApp installed because we will be installing it while doing the process. So when you type in WhatsApp on your Play Store, you will see that WhatsApp is not installed on my Samsung smartphone, which is one of the condition to transfer everything. I'm doing this process on the Samsung Galaxy smartphone, but you can choose any other Android smartphone and the process will be almost the same. The only prerequisite to install in the Android smartphone is the application Smart Switch. So this is the application you can install on any Android smartphone. So when you open the application, you will enter this page of the transfer. I would always recommend to take a complete backup of your WhatsApp chat on your iPhone. So something goes wrong, you will have a backup of all all your chats so go to your whatsapp go to settings go to chats click on chat backup since i have already taken the backup but you can take the backup anytime by clicking on backup so by doing so you are securing all your whatsapp chats and anything goes wrong during the transfer you are not worried about so i have taken the backup of all my chats now all these chats will be transferred to my android smartphone and how will I do that? Let's see step by step. So click on settings on your iPhone. Click on chats. Over here you have two options. Move chat to Android and transfer chats to iPhone. Since we are transferring chat to Android smartphone, click on the first option. Move chats to Android. And it will give you a page of starting the transfer process. Click on start. It will get the chats ready. And we are on the smart switch application on our Android smartphone. So now you have the message on your iPhone screen that continue on your new phone. So click on receive on this phone option. Since we are transferring from an iPhone, click on the iPhone option. Now this is very important. We can use wirelessly, but the cable option is always preferable because the data transfer speed will be better and more faster. And since both the smartphones use type C cable, I have to just connect type C. So after connecting the type C cable on both these smartphones, click on next. Again, click on next. Trust the phone by entering your code. Again, click on next. So it's asking us to transfer all the data, calls, messages, applications, settings. But for this video, we just want to transfer WhatsApp data. So I will uncheck on all. And since WhatsApp is an application, I will choose the application option. Click on transfer again. And again, I can transfer 48 selected applications. But again, the focus for this video is WhatsApp. I uncheck on all and just choose WhatsApp. So in the beginning of the video, I told you not to install WhatsApp on your Android smartphone because now with this process, we will install WhatsApp application on the Android smartphone. Click on install. So there are two ways. You can either open the camera on your iPhone and scan this barcode and the transfer will start. And there is another method. You can click on cancel over here, cancel the transfer. And again, you can click on the move chats to Android option and again, start the process. So either you can scan the barcode or you can use this way. Both will work seamlessly and accurately. So everything is done on the iPhone. We again click on the code just to give an authorization and the transfer process has started. I can click on this, keep the screen on. Since the data is quite big, it will take some time. I will fast forward the process, but as you can see, it will take minimum one hour, 13 minutes. And since we are transferring via cable, it's gonna be a little bit more faster than the normal Wi-Fi process. So since the transfer is done, we don't need the USB cable, we can disconnect it. And here we go. Finally, the data has been transferred successfully. 
To be honest, it was a very big data, 35 GB. That's why it took a lot of time, almost one and a half hour, close to one hour, 45 minutes. So just one application, which is WhatsApp of 35 GB of storage with all my videos, my chats, the pictures and everything has been transferred. Now let's see whether everything has been transferred successfully by opening up the WhatsApp application, clicking on next. So now we are on Android. We don't need iMessage. You can turn it off on your iPhone. Get your cloud data. We don't need that. So all set. Click on done. Open WhatsApp. Again, we have to install by the same number which we are using in our iPhone. Enter a different number. And I will get the code over here. So this is my code. After verifying everything, I'm logged out from my iPhone and, and I'm logging into my Android smartphone. Import chat history. Allow. Allow all. These are the last steps. So we are almost done with importing all the chats and all the data of WhatsApp. And here it is. The import is complete. Click on next. Type on the name, click on next, click on yes. So all the chats are transferred and we can choose our backup style, not now. So as you can see over here, all my chats, all the messages, almost 35 GB of data has been transferred. So everything has been loaded. Videos, everything is done all have been transferred so guys that's it for this video i think this is one of the best way to transfer all your whatsapp chats from your iphone to android device it's a very easy and convenient method you don't need to do any factory reset so if you have a new android smartphone and you want to change it from your iphone try this method and you're going to enjoy it it's just that depending on your chat uh, size and the data it will take some time to transfer everything, but uh, you will not lose any data. You will have everything backed up and everything transferred. If you have any questions or difficulties while doing the transfer, please do write me in the comments below and I will make sure to answer all your comments. So that's it for this video, guys. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you liked the video, kindly hit the thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't. See you all soon in my next video. Till then, goodbye, peace and blessings.